excuse me, Pam in the black, blue, pink, and orange. Sonny Edwards in the green. In the neon green, have you noticed he's emphasizing the war in Ed Ward's beautiful. And you can see early on, massive reach advantage for Ben Rodriguez. Seven inch reach advantage coming into this fight. They want him using that jab early and often, and they want him targeting the body with that jab. But Bam's got to make it work hard. That, that's the whole point. Yeah, good body shot from Bam. And then a right hand on the inside. You know, it's interesting. We're not seeing Sonny move quite as much or in quite the same way we've seen him move in past fights. A lot of times in previous fights, he gives you a lot of lateral movement, using the entirety of the ring. Now, seems content at the moment to operate out of the center of it. No, I think you... I think he's had a good round so far, me, Bam. Good shot to the body right there, but the check cut by Sonny. It's back and forth. Look at the right hand from Sonny. Look, look at the left eye of Sonny Edwards. Yeah, big mouse there. You, you're right, and that was way low, but that could be a real issue for Edwards. Oh, that, that eye is going to get ugly quick. Wow, good job. Lovely job there from Bam. I hope they've got the ends well ready to go in the corner, Barry. That's a real problem. For a man who needs, the, who needs that vision to react. You guys know when you're a fighter and you see that mouse in the eye, it becomes the target that you aim at all night long. It's a bullseye for that right jab, that snappy jab of Bam Rodriguez. And that's what caused it right there because you can see that Bam continues going for that eye with that right jab. There it is right there, popping it. Let him go. Sonny Let him go. told We're Bam this week, he said, no. man, you never wanted to fight no. me. We had to beg you and bait you into this fight. And Bam said, what are you talking about? I called you out after I broke. Good movement off the ropes there from Sonny Edwards. A couple of shots and then skipping away. See, right now, this is a fencing match between the jab. You know, both these fighters want to get established that long jab. Bam Rodriguez has an upper hand right now so far, but the faster hand, the quicker jab is actually with Edwards. But there's that check hook. Yeah, it's a good, good lovely little short hook, well, long hook, wasn't it? Oh, the jab from, Ed, uh, from Bam is fantastic. Right on the right. Sonny's getting hit more than he normally does, Barry. Yeah, th th this is not the range Sonny Edwards wants to be at. I I'm actually surprised he's this stationary at this stage of the fight. He hasn't got a point to prove. He thinks he's got a point to prove. He's going to lose the fight. You've got to do what you're good at. Plenty of feints, moving around the that semicircle around the, around the target. Use that. Oh, nice left from Sonny, who's sitting down on his punches. Yeah. And he catches him again with a left. He took a heavy jab, didn't he? But he committed with that, that left hand over the top there, Edwards. And again. He's, he's, like you said, Barry, now he's starting to be first more often, Sonny. Good footwork there, though, from, from Bam Rodriguez, not allowing Edwards any momentum in that little attack. Good scrap so far. A little more physical, perhaps, than we thought. Nice job in the corner, by the way, on the eye of Sonny Edwards. It seems to have actually gotten better. Ooh, good shot. Lovely shot. The smile on the face of Edwards there as well. Whoa, nice counter left. Sonny now just ate a right. This thing's heating up. Bam, starting to get inside. He felt that little shot there, Edwards. Sonny Edwards, right through the guard. I think Bam Rodriguez has lost respect for whatever's coming back. He's not respecting the power, he's not respecting the speed anymore. Closing the distance much easier now. This is a boxing purist delight. This is quickly going to turn into a fight, though. You can see Edwards slowing down, biting that gum shield, and he's throwing back with harder shots. He knows he's going to have to fight off Bam. Two things I've never heard of. Oh, Bam caught him off balance, and now Sonny's sitting down throwing bombs. But that's the, he got hurt there, Sonny. That's the fight to him. He got hurt. His first reaction was to fire back. I think Sonny tried to move to his left without stepping. He didn't try to pivot. So that's why he got caught by Bam Rodriguez. Against the southpaw, if you're not going to step to the left, you're not going to pivot right. You're going to be in the, in, the, in the line of fire at the right hook. Of the South Pole. 
Let's check in with Chris Mannix. Robert, how do you feel about what you're seeing so far? Uh, it's a good fight. The Sun is fighting a good fight, but I think Bam is controlling with the power punches. Little by little, you know, Jab is doing really well. So, you know, it's just, uh, you know, a matter of time, round by round. What do you want to see Bam doing over these next couple of rounds? This is the jab, block, block, and counter. Block, block, and counter. Thanks, Robert. I love that Robert, the first thing he said, he, he basically showed respect for what Sonny was doing. Yeah, well, he's, he's doing really well, but I, th I think he's got a point, especially in like Armstrong. You've got to sort of think the weight of the shots of, of Rodriguez is maybe going to give him the nods in some of the close rounds. Good but Sonny's not him some good shots as well. Good counter shot to the body by Pat Rodriguez. Look at that. Take it down. It's Bam, Bam goes low, Sonny goes high. Yeah, but down is going to be... It's going to be a better investment going downstairs to the body for Bam Rodriguez. Oh, look at this. Fantastic stuff. Sonny says if he wins, he wants Chocolatino. I wonder what he's thinking as he watches this from Nicaragua. Okay, that was low right there, right there. That one was low. Have you ever seen Bam take this, or excuse me, Sonny take this kind of damage, Barry? No, of course we have, but I've never seen him some of this as good as this either. Oh, now Bam's talking, and Sonny might be in hurt. because you're not a big puncher. You're used to people trying to beat you Barry, out. you weren't a big puncher. I wasn't a big puncher, but look, this is exactly what we're seeing. Oh, lovely work from Bam. Oh, Bam sitting down on those power punches. Bam swinging away with power, Sonny, rolling with those big punches. A lot of work to be done in the corner of Edwards. And Sonny can keep moving, but I'm just not going to stop coming. I don't know. I don't see that in Sonny's legs right now. I see a little buckle on his legs. Oh, there's, there's a big left hand on the inside for Rodriguez. Fatigue is setting in the legs of Sonny Edwards. They won't betray them. There's a heavy left hand there for Rodriguez. Out of body shots. Sonny's legs, his conditioning is betraying him right here. That was a lovely jab there from Edwards. And there's so much blood, but it does look like a cut now above the right eye of Sonny Edwards. Oh, what an uppercut there from Rodriguez. Look at Edwards fighting back. Both of these fighters giving us everything they've got that's worthy of a world title bout. We talked about this a few rounds ago. They're going to wave it off. And that's it! Bam Rodriguez, the king of the flyweights! That was a beatdown that Bam Rodriguez just put on the undefeated champ in Sunday Edwards. That's flyweight supremacy by Bam Rodriguez. Ladies and gentlemen, we need a round of sound for both of these two men that just put their belts, their records, and their legacies on the line. Referee Chris Flores calls a halt to this contest as the red corner throws in the towel at one second of round. 